do much wonder that one man, seeing how much another man is a fool when he dedicates his behaviors to love, will, after he hath laughed at such shallow follies in others, become the argument of his own scorn by falling in love. Such a man as Claudio. I have known when there was no music with him but the drum and the fife. And now he'd rather hear the tabor and the pipe. I have known when he would have walked ten mile afoot to see good armor. And now he will lie ten nights awake, craving the fashion of a new doublet. I was wont to speak plain and with purpose, like an honest man and a soldier. And now he has turned to orthodox. His words are a very fantastical banquet. Just so many strange dishes. May I be so converted and see with mine own eyes? I cannot tell. I think not. I will be sworn, but love may transform me into an oyster. And I'll take my oath on it. Till he hath made an oyster of me, he shall never make me such a fool. One woman is fair, yet I am well. Another is wise, yet I am well. Another virtuous, yet I am well. But till all graces be in one woman, one woman shall not come to my grace. Rich she shall be, that much is certain. Wise, or I'll none. Virtuous, or I'll never cheapen her. Fair, or I'll never look on her. Mild, or come not near me. <laughs> Noble, or are not I for an angel. A good discourse, an excellent musician, and her hair shall be... Of what color it please God?